Hi, welcome to the Holly Area Community Show. I'm your host, Verna, brought to you by the Shooting Star Casino, Hotel and Entertainment of Monoman, Minnesota. We are located at Wright Funeral Home in Holly today with Funeral Director Adam Nardian. Thanks for joining us, Adam. You're welcome. I think we'll share with our viewers your experience and background. How long have you been with Wright Funeral Home? Sure, I've been uh, with Wright Funeral Home for four years now. Um, a licensed funeral director for six years okay. and uh, for two years I worked in uh, St. Paul, uh, South St. Paul and West St. Paul and uh, was able to, to move up originally growing up in Thief River. Okay. Um, got to move a little closer so to family. A closer and to so home. You did your schooling so, in the cities and this correct, is yeah. a lot closer so that helps. Yep. Okay. Um, Wright Funeral has locations in Moorhead, Holly and Lake Park, correct? Correct. Okay. Um, Let's share with our audience, Adam, some pre-planning arrangements. Okay. Um, can you tell our viewers why it would be a good idea to pre-plan their funeral arrangements? Well, you know, for many people it's a peace of mind just having, uh, just knowing that the plans are out there, um, they, they have them set, and it's peace of mind for the individual uh, as well as the family. Sure. Um, that, um, the, the plans are out there and they don't have to worry about them anymore. Okay, and do um, people usually come to you after having used your services with other family members maybe or how do they go about making that contact with you? Well, you know, we see a lot of people that that have had family in the past prearrange a funeral and they know how important it can be okay. uh, to to have that all all in order when they when they get here. So. Uh, you can't plan ahead for everything, but mm -hmm. um, some plans can be done sure. at the time. Okay, so if an individual would like to pre-plan, what should they expect the process to all entail? Well, um, not not everyone um, needs to be uh, over to the funeral home to, to plan. Uh, it's it. The important part is really to to go through the with the family, um, whether you come into the funeral home right away or not just uh, to have those plans out in the air, I guess, with okay. family. Um, for some people, it's hard to uh, to make, get those plans ahead of time. Uh, for others, they just view it as uh, a fact of life mm -hmm. and, and know that um, I can just get these plans down. So to have those, to have those down uh, really can make okay. a big difference. When, when they come into the funeral home, um, some of the the big picture questions that you know is a good place to start uh, when you're talking with family uh, really where where you have differences in services it can be uh, traditional burial mm -hmm. uh, it can be cremation uh, a lot of times people will have a traditional possible viewing um, visitation before the funeral um, and cremation to follow so some of those are important questions that, that people start with uh, when they come into the funeral home, you know, it, it gives us a better idea of where to start. Right. Um, some people go go ahead with with making those plans, um, making details, uh, even down to uh, songs if they they have a favorite song, sure. some scripture that mm -hmm. would be uh, important or meaningful uh, to the individual. And uh, others just want to come in to to fund the 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 funeral, okay. so that it may be. Um, a burden lifted from the family right. at some point and, and so um, you can you can do uh, one or the other and sometimes people do both so okay. it's really important to to get get those plans okay. with family uh, done and yeah, burial cremation sometimes people choose donation as well so they also choose what is that uh, donation, donation sometimes and... correct okay. um, not necessarily uh, b donation would be an alternative uh, for maybe a medical school uh, donation oh, okay. to science as, sure. as opposed to uh, having the funeral uh, with, with burial at a okay. cemetery or cremation right okay. away. Okay, and so. there's a lot of details involved, so that's why it's important to pre-plan. Correct. Um, yep. Good information with Adam Nardine at the Wright Funeral Home in Holly. Adam, would you please tell our audience how to contact you or give your website? Sure. Uh, our website is www.wrightfuneral.com. Um, our phone number in Holly is 218 4 Eight three four four one one, and our address is 404 Leonard Street, which is on the west edge of town, right on uh, Highway 10. Uh, in Moorhead, we are at uh, 605 Second Avenue South, and the phone number is 
233-1321. Okay, thanks again, Adam. You're welcome. Welcome back to the Holly Area Community Show. I am at the Holly Library today with our librarian, Joy Becker. Thanks for joining us again, Joy. Thank you for having me, Brenda. Yes. We want to share with you guys some big events coming up at the library. There's always stuff happening here. Yep. We're here on a Wednesday evening. That's a rather busy. <laughs> so we're going to try to get some info out to you quick for Joy. Um, do you want to share with the audience what's coming up? Yeah, we've got some great events coming up between January and March. Uh, we've got story time coming up on a regular basis every Friday at 1030. Our Hot Reads for Cold Nights kicks off on January 4th and runs through March 26th. That's a reading program for adults where for every four books they read, they get entered into a drawing for prizes. Or they're not big prizes, but they're yeah, weekly prizes. prizes. It's kind of fun. And they can just pick up the little slips from you, right? Yep, when they that's come right. In? Okay. And the kickoff for that is a book discussion on January 6th at 6.30 for about the literary, Guernsey Literary and Potato Peel Pie Society. Okay. It sounds like a great book. I haven't had a chance to read it yeah, yet. but a popular one, so we're hoping to get a lot of interested folks yep. in to discuss it. Yep, and if that goes well, we will do it again on a regular basis. Okay. We've also got a computer class coming up on genealogy research on the internet and using some of the library's research um, resources for genealogy as well. Mm -hmm. And we've always got our board game night the last Tuesday of the month. That's really fun. Okay. Um, and that again is for all ages. That's for all ages, yeah. Family event or come by yourself, bring your own games yeah. or play some of ours. Yeah. So um, you have a lot of kids' favorites here. So. We do, we yeah. do. And this next time we're going to try and have a Star Wars Trivial Pursuit. Ooh, okay. cool. So cool. Should be pretty fun. Okay. And um, I want everyone to be well aware that if the flag is up, we are open. Okay. A lot of people walk over, so there isn't always cars outside. So yeah. make sure you look for that flag if okay. you're not sure if we're open or not. Um, oh, really? Also in the winter months when the weather isn't so great, uh, I want everyone to remember they can renew their books online and they can also download audiobooks both for kids and for adults. There's also tumble books for little kids that they can read online. Mm -hmm. It's kind of like a picture book online. Yeah. Flips the pages for They're them really and cool, yeah. highlights the words as it goes. It's yeah. pretty neat. Um, we've got our display case filled with the Wednesday Night Crafters. Have you oh, seen that? Oh, cool. No, we'll have to peek. A lot okay. of great stuff. Cool. Yeah. Sounds exciting. What else is new in the library system? I think a couple weeks ago you shared with me um, a change in the e-audio downloads. Yes, they are available for iPod users uh, now too. Okay. Um, and they've changed the way the net library works, so I think it's a lot more user friendly and a lot easier to download from the, Good. the library system right onto the media yeah. instead of having to download it and then transfer right. it over. It's really After nice. After being in use for the first year, so testing all right. the way through the bumps. Right. right. Okay. And it's a lot easier to browse and look through the, the selections available. Awesome. Yeah. All right. Well, thanks, Joy. We got a lot coming up. Thanks for joining us. Thank Holly you. Holly Public Library. Thanks for joining the Holly Community Show.